Okay, so Alu is here mm -hmm. and uh, so let's get started. Uh, first is some uh, Litecoin chain statistics. Uh, I've shared the screen. I hope that uh, you can see it. Uh, the, uh, starting from this week, I will only uh, I will not report the migrated token since uh, that's not our uh, that's not our not our main target anymore. Uh, we post some uh, basic chain data and the trust to show uh, to show the trend. Uh, this week, the uh, number of addresses increased a few, uh, about three hundred to about six hundred uh, six thousand seven hundred. And uh, as you can see in the chart, the uh, the trend is about uh, linear. It is about linear incre linearly increasing as a straight line, and the number of transactions also increased uh, about nine thousand to eighty seven thousand, and it's also uh, increasing about linearly. The number of dedicated tokens uh, uh, not increased a lot, uh, less than one million. Uh, I think the number of dedicated token is uh, is uh, about uh, slowing down and about uh, is about constant now, and I think it will remain at the level of two hundred and fifty million like coins. Last week, I was uh, mainly working on the Litecoin SD, uh, Litecoin button SDK, which is to uh, for uh, developers. Uh, writers or developers to ingest the uh, like button on their web page and I was mainly uh, investigating the uh, how the Facebook SDK is, uh, is doing the uh, doing the same thing and this week I will continue working on Litecoin button SDK and would also uh, investigate the Cosmos game of zones uh, they are having some progress uh, and, may, uh, and they said that they will start the game of zones in the in the, uh, in the first quarter, so maybe uh, it's, it should be very soon. And also, uh, since Keen has uh, moved it, uh, Litecoin docu uh, documents onto GitHub, I will edit the uh, Litecoin chain related parts of the GitHub. That's it. Hello, this is Michael. Last week, uh, I have uh, my greatest all our Elasticsearch API and other things to the AWS process servers. And the old one will be installed today or tomorrow if there is no other issue found. And second, I have uh, updated our user data to distinguish users from Meta's media channel so we can do platform specific data analysis from now on. And this week, I will add a, a coin job to update useful data to Intercom so that everyone can use those data to send email campaign easy and decrease its workload for manual update to Intercom. And then I will start to write a data aggregation flow for our c Leica and white task statistics report and write the end API. That's all. Uh, I William and last week I last week I was working on the Chrome extension MVC and I have completed and submitted the draft to uh Google Chrome Web Store and it just got uh reviewed and published and currently it is unlisted so we leaked the link to extension to for users to install and try out our extension and also I was working on some API changes to uh, make the bookmark functionality for the extension. And I also drafted the LightPay library design and some doc structure, but I haven't filled out the actual contents yet, and maybe I will do it later this week. Also, I was working on some POC on LightButton with Khan, and I have already uh, implemented the feature and it is under review and maybe I will release it today and see how the read data will actually uh, turns out because uh, we still have no 
actual idea of how to um, define the with action. And so this week I will continue to work on uh, iterating the we can design and also I will start to uh, implement the like pay line with PLC. That's it. Hello, this is David. And uh, last week I uh, I finished the wallet screen relocation and uh, fixed the related bugs. And I have tried to uh, integrate the off-core profile and setting screen in the app, but uh, but we have to wait for off-core to update their uh, React Native module in uh, late February. And I also handled the app for bookmarking uh, the non icon button integration content. And I have to implement the desktop version of the newly re rendered Civic page. And I will uh, implement the mobile version this week. And also, I'm preparing the release notes for the app version 0.15.0. Which support the uh, uh, bookmark Chrome extension and also the uh, wallet relocation. And I will also finish the following settings in the app once uh, Joshua finished the design. That's it. Hello, this is Edmund. Um, last week, uh, a rise was observed since February the, uh, uh, 2nd due to the uh, cor cor coronavirus incident outbreak. And um, the new users were mostly from mainland China. It's about 78%, uh, which is shown in, uh, uh, in the diagram, in the pie chart here. and uh, they, they they are shown as from Singapore, uh, and the reason is most likely because of they are using VPN. And um, a boost of uh, active civic Leica is also observed. Uh, you can see it in the in the, in the chart right uh, in, in in the line chart here. And um, uh, however, the the intake of civic Leica. I mean, the new registrations of Civic Leica remains a uh, horizontal move and uh, is not, uh, uh, we, we cannot observe the, uh, a, a rise according to the uh, 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 active Leica's increase. That means the, the efficiency of the conversion is not good. The new registered user um, cannot be converted to Civic Leica uh, 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 efficiently. Uh, last week also, uh, there is uh, a point to note, Facebook has changed their policy and they banned our active and new advertisement last week. The Civic Leica registration intake velocity was slightly affected and we are still finding a way to sort out how to, how to, how to solve this problem. Uh, I was also working on the Chinese email promotion campaign and, and it takes up uh, most of the time uh, last week. Uh, I tried to uh, uh, I tried to massage the content based on the characteristics of the users. And also I'm preparing for the uh, new uh, campaign for the for the cool down users, which are going to be handled by another tool, MailChimp. And this week, in the coming week, I will uh, continue to work to uh, analyze, uh, analyze the active likers, uh, newly intake, in, uh, which is newly registered last week. I'll try to set up some promotions or some content, uh, outreach content, I mean, to, uh, uh, to address them. And also, uh, uh, I, will, I will prepare some Chinese documentations, uh, including the newly deployed Gitbook. Um, yes, that's it for my part. 
Uh, hello, this is Josh here. Uh, last week, uh, I completed the design for slash civic, uh, which is for a uh, civic like page for introductions. And uh, I think that is uh, making uh, development it, and also supported a uh, William William on the Chrome plugin for uh, uh for the plug install feature image screenshot, uh, so on. And this week I will design UI for the follow and unfollow on the app, and continue to design. The compact in. That's it. Hello, hello here. <clears throat> uh, last week, uh, I shared the code base between the IPFS IPLD plugin and the Go IPFS default plugin, and tried to. Uh, Make it in the uh, same code base with two different projects and POC it on the uh, Cosmos Store plugin, and it is still developing. So uh, I will keep doing it this week. Um, yesterday, uh, the Meta Scroll uh, tell us that uh, some GraphQL uh, use case. Maybe that is useful on the uh, ISCN, so I may take some time to try to research about it. Yes, that's it. Uh, this is Kim from uh, Taiwan. So last week I mainly spent time on rewriting the um, Litecoin user guide and uh, documentation from the ground up. And uh, I can share the screen for the progress on um, Geekbook. Is it showing? Uh, no. no. Not yet. Is it? Nope. No. no. Mm, let me try again. Du, du, du. Okay. Here. So okay, it's uh, working now. Can you see now? So it's totally open. So um other than our own team who will be uh putting various documentations, having them integrated in this uh book. Uh, it would be open for everyone to uh, to add and amend and localize. Uh, that would be uh, our uh, continuous task. I'm also evaluating uh, various platforms for uh, crowdfunding for our uh, next year's uh, budget. And one of one of the platform that I, I we, we might use would be uh, Open Collective OpenCollective.com. Uh, you may check it out. And then um, I'm submitting, I, I'm half done submitting a topic to present Civic Like Movement at the Creative Commons Global Summit. And uh, the, the very first proposal of Likeland was wasted on a test net last week. And um, I'll, I'll be contacting the uh, validators to to review and also to try uh, their vote. And within this week, have the proposal officially wasted on the mainnet. Also, uh, harder to report, uh, harder to update uh, uh, some researchers on the, uh, mainly regarding the substitutions on, from, um, from the perspective of uh, substituting Paywall and cost content solutions such as Medium, uh, Substack, and and the uh, Patreon and etc. How Lightland can turn into a substitute for for all these uh, set of um, content monetization solution, but uh, closed it. 
and uh, attended two podcasts, which will be aired um, maybe later this week or I'm not sure when, but uh, I'll update again when it's uh, published. And uh, I couldn't really uh, meet many people in Taiwan because of the virus issues of people have concerned. So uh, that's basically my week over. Uh, any other business? Anyone has uh, anything for discussion? Or any question from audience? Uh, well, uh, just uh, sing with us uh, what he's doing on like uh, IPFS content reader and stuff and maybe uh, we will be cooperating with him uh, uh, in the future so maybe everyone should take a note of what he's saying. Is that just me and I? I'm not sure about. Nah, uh, I haven't noticed that. Uh, I will have a look on the, uh, on the thread. No, uh, anything else? If no, then uh, that's, the, uh, that's the end of uh, this meeting. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.